All right, step two now to make the perfect gravy. The ginger garlic that I showed you, I have blended them with a the help with little water. First, we'll fry this, then well done, nine is nine coriander that I show you. I potted them fresh turmeric, uh, coriander, then One these turmeric, and half teaspoon of red chilies. Chilies you can increase and decrease according. Red chilies you can increase and decrease according to your liking, but my little one doesn't like spices much, so I try to use as much least in quantity as possible. That me and my husband we use freshly cut uh, green chilies, right? First they little fry they are, then we are going to add this. Uh, the onion that I had stir fried half done. Now I'm going to add. This then, right? I think from here you can have clear focus of the onion and once these ginger garlic, coriander, red chilies, turmeric, and onions have been fried. Then we will add this 125 gram yogurt into it. All right, my flame still is medium to low, not high. The ginger garlic paste. Or the, or the blended form I have added now I'm frying it see the steam has started and you can see little bubbles here at the bottom now once they have reduced all the moisture then I'm gonna add red chilies turmeric and coriander all right see moisture has been reduced i'm going to add my fresh coriander seeds along with just one stirring just one stirring then i'm going to add my red chilies and turmeric see now I can smell the aroma of turmeric red chilies I'm gonna add now my blended onion See already 60% onions have been fried previously so only we need now to reduce this liquid and then the yogurt will be added to it. All right. Keep stirring, keep stirring, keep stirring till you see oil separating from this mixture. Constant stirring, constant stirring, and constant stirring. But in the end, you will you will be loving the end result of this gravy. All smooth. See, the oil has started separating from the mixture. Little more stirring. Then I'm going to add yogurt in in it. Oil is separated from the mixture now. This is the time to add yogurt now. Now I'm going to add 125 gram yogurt in it. Blend it. The same method, the same technique. Keep stirring, keep stirring till you see oil separated from this mixture and then your perfect gravy the foundation of all gravy is the mother of all gravy is cooked raw now this is this is the gravy in which at this stage 
after this frying after this complete stir, stir frying process if you are cooking fish gravy you can add fenugreek seeds carom seeds or if it's lamb chicken so you can add spices accordingly uh, like um, cinnamon sticks uh, cloves black pepper whole black pepper to give that korma look and if it's fish then the specifically um, uh, not to mention that um, kusuri methi fenugreek leaves that you will add Oil has started separating from the mixture, so let me see. let me check. see. So this is a stage at which this gravy has thoroughly been cooked through. At this point, you can add water. If it's vegetable gravy, add vegetables according to your choice: lamb, chicken, fish, whatever you want. This is a foundation gravy, mother of all gravies, and a perfect gravy.